Hello, I'm Ginger Jesus. This is Nerd Foo. So, as part of my YouTube channel, there's a series of videos I have on here called uh, Demystifying Tai Chi, and this will be part of that series. And I want to talk about the term filling your body with chi, or the concept of filling your body with chi, because it's a real concept, it just needs to be looked at differently. <clears throat> So the ancient Chinese didn't know much about, or much at all, about the concept of muscle contraction theory. They also didn't know much about the nervous system and how it worked. They had a lot of great guesses and a lot of good ideas, but they didn't exactly know exactly how things worked, which is important because we have two nervous systems in our body. We have one that reacts to stress which is the sympathetic nervous system. We have one that rela reacts when we are relaxed, which is the sympathetic nervous system. Now that's important because different parts of the nervous system are active at different times and you can do things with them that you can't do otherwise. For instance, when we are stressed, when we are in the sympathetic nervous system, when people touch us, our bodies often respond to that with stress because that is, how our, that is the nervous system that is on. So we receive that touch as external stress. So we move away, we get into a guard position, how, whatever your fight or flight is. Maybe even if it's freeze, you may freeze out of fear until you look over and see your buddy. <clears throat> so these things are part of how our body is wired. Now the reason why I bring all that up is the parasympathetic nervous system. The nervous system that works when we are relaxed runs internally. I mean, our sympathetic nervous system also runs internally, and our parasympathetic nervous system runs externally as well. That's why we can hug and embrace, shake hands, things like that. Now, internally, we're talking about a skill called interoception. Well, we're calling it, we're, to sense the, 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 the nerve endings inside your body is known as interoception. Training interoception is a skill usually done through meditation. You know, we close our eyes, we put our brain inside our body, we try to feel our muscles, our sinew. We try to connect our brain with those parts of our body, and those parts of, their of our body have nerve endings. Now, they're part of the sympathetic nervous system, parasympathetic nervous system, so if you want to feel inside your body, you have to be relaxed. How does this equate to filling our bodies with chi? The parasympathetic nervous system runs through the fascial layers, and the fascial layers run around the muscles. So a muscle fiber, bam, has fascia surrounding it. And then many muscle fibers have fascia surrounding them. And then the muscle belly has fascia surrounding it. And when the strings of fascia exit the muscle belly on both ends, they become the tendons. The tendons and the fascia inside the muscle are the same exact thing. When our muscles relax, they release. This isn't new information. But when we're trying to feel inside our body, we don't feel the muscle fibers releasing. We feel the fascia around the muscle fibers getting further away from each other. We fill our nervous system inside our body, and it feels as if something is filling it as everything releases. In reality, what we're filling that space with, space with is relaxed muscles. That's it. At the end of the day, that's what it is. When you can't, when there is a blockage to your chi, when there is something you can't feel, that means you have something in that muscle not allowing it to release. I suggest massage. Or more interception training. I'm Ginger Jesus. This is Nerd Foo. Be good to yourselves out there.